So in Ireland, ETFs are not taxed favorably, so I need to do something about that and come up with a creative way that I can essentially invest in an ETF without having to pay them higher taxes. For example, and I know this differs by country, but for me, I live in Ireland, so this is what the case is in Ireland. But for example, individual stocks are taxed at capital gains rate of 33% on profits. Whereas if you invest in an ETF, you'll have to pay 41% tax on profits and dividends. And as well as that with ETFs, you likely have some sort of management fee in there as well to consider on top of that 41%. Another benefit to investing in individual stocks is that you can actually offset your losses in a given year against gains in a future year. But in ETFs, you cannot do that. So basically, in Ireland anyway, it's not ideal to be investing in ETFs. From a tax standpoint, that is, of course, it is easy if you don't have that much time but still want to invest in a diversified basket of companies, ETFs are probably a good idea then. But if you do have a little more time to allocate to your investing and are able to research some individual stocks, I think we found a way that we can essentially invest in an ETF, but with those benefits of the individual stock investing. But before we get into how I did this, I'd just like to thank the sponsor of today's video, Scramble Invest. This is essentially a platform that allows peer-to-peer -peer lending, whereas a group of investors can come together and pool their money in order to fund a variety of businesses across the UK and continental Europe. Every month, Scramble Invest present investors with a batch which consists of a group of exciting customer goods startups seeking growth capital. And then as investors, we don't invest in just one of these companies, but in fact, we invest in the whole batch in this certain round. Within these rounds, there are two types of term loans. We have Group A and Group B, with Group A being a little bit less profitable at 5% for six months, but still a really, really good return, and the repayments are made monthly for this with that 5% being paid immediately after the end of the round. And while the Group A does not offer as much as Group B in terms of the rate of return for this investment, it is more secure, so you're taking on a bit less risk there. Group B, on the other hand, is more profitable at a great 9% for six months of investing, which is really, really attractive. And for this one, the payment is made at the end of the six month period. Not only that, Scramble Invest have their own skin in the game and they invest up to 20% of the money in each round themselves. The minimum amount that you can invest on Scramble is 10 euro. And at the moment, there's currently a bonus program in place where an investor can earn an extra five euro with every hundred euro that they invest in a certain round. Really interesting product from Scramble Invest there. So if any of you guys are interested and wanna check it out, you can see the link down in the description below. So back to my ETF story. So I was essentially going to invest in the Dow Jones, but then I decided that I would make my own pie on trading 212 and just basically grab them 30 stocks from the Dow Jones and put them into this pie. Now you can see here that it's actually called Dow 32, whereas the Dow Jones normally has 30 stocks in it, but that's because I decided to add two extra stocks in here that I like, those being Tesla and Palantir. So if we jump into the pie here, you can see that of these 32, I have Tesla at 5%, I also have Chevron at 5%, and then all of the rest are weighted at 3% equally. So that means for every 100 euro I put into this Dow 32 pie, five of that will go to Tesla, five of that will go to Chevron, and then three euro of that to each of the other stocks respectively. Now that 5% and 3% rating isn't equivalent to what they're weighted in the Dow Jones. I just wanted to do that from my own personal point of view to make it a bit easier for myself, and I'm quite happy having them all at equal weightings there. So essentially each month, I'll put a portion of my capital that I'm investing that month into this pie. I would simply just go to the overview page. I would click invest. Then I would put in whatever amount I want to invest. You can see, seeing as I have over 30 stocks, the minimum I can invest in this pie is 33 euro. Otherwise, if it was a smaller amount, it wouldn't be able to divvy it up equally enough, seeing as there is over 30 there. But yeah, basically I would invest into each of them at the equal weightings. And then after every couple of months, I would come down to the bottom here, click rebalance, and then as you can see, it would sell bits of different stocks and buy bits of other stocks in order to keep them at that weighting that I've set. So you can see some of the stocks that are included here. It's basically just the Dow Jones stocks with Tesla and Palantir included in there as well. But what I'll do is I'll leave a link down in the description below for any of you who already have Trading212. You can check out this pie and then maybe copy it or recreate it yourself. And for those of you who haven't signed up to Trading212 yet, I'll also leave a link down in the description below where you guys can sign up and get up to 100 euro of a free stock. So yeah, that's essentially it. I'm investing in the Dow Jones now essentially, but it's under more favorable conditions as each of them are individual stocks. 
and I also have the dividends set up to automatically reinvest there as well. So I'll be taking advantage of compound interest. But yeah, love to know your thoughts on this. Let me know down in the comment section below if you'll be copying this pie or if you'll be signing up to Trading212 to take advantage of this feature. Also, let me know if you do end up checking out Scramble Invest. As you've seen in the video, I invested 150 euro into that first round. And so far, I'm really liking the platform. But anyway, guys, thanks so much for watching. If you did enjoy this video, make sure you do drop a like on it. Really appreciate it. And I'll catch you guys in another video.